So Jedi Joy just called me. She went to the mailbox, and today is Monday, July 27th. Uh, years 2020, 14 hours, four, five minutes right now. And they had just, in the mail, they just got the birth certificate. Her birth certificate just showed up like uh, about a week ahead of schedule probably. I sensed it would, but it came today. And then we have an appointment today with the passport office at 6.30. So it's, it's right now, it's 2.06, okay? And we have an appointment at 6.30. And so if it wasn't in the mail, we were gonna miss that passport uh, appointment. And they don't do online anymore. It's all in person, so you gotta set an appointment. So we were like, man, we don't have the birth certificate. We're gonna have this. I guess we'll have to wait or go to storage tomorrow and, and reschedule and, and blow this one off. But she just said that the mail came and she because she ran out there. It's two o'clock and she has a client at three. And if we have to run out there, we were wondering if we had to go to storage or not. So it doesn't mean we don't have to go to storage. What it means is that we just have to. Uh, Save myself twenty goddamn dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Save myself $20 and almost missed our trip, but save myself $20. Yeah, explain what happened here, Jack. Oh my gosh. This is the best fucking news. So Jenna Rich has been telling me we need to get our birth certificates. And I technically have one. He doesn't have one. I technically have one. It's in our storage unit, but it's a horrible copy that they might not even accept it. Got it. Uh, Sacramento, Sacramento, California. I was like, yes, I, I told her, I said, oh, this is exactly what I wanted. You just made my month. Thank you. She's like, oh, thank you. Uh, the friend is, so get this. So I technically have one in storage, but the copy is so bad. I mean, it's an original, but it's been used so many times. I've had it since I was three. My mom ordered an official document when I was three, and it's been used for like five passports, and it's just been, you can barely read it. So I didn't even know if they'd accept it. So Jairich was telling me, telling me to get it, and then he said, should I pay $20? We didn't know we were going to do anything. We didn't know we were moving, nothing. He just said, we need to get our birth certificates because we need to get our passports again for the future. And I was like, don't waste $20. Because it was like $20 to make sure but, not but, only got on time, but that it didn't get lost. Yeah, yeah. So I was like, oh, but it's $40. So I was like, well, that's half of the way there. So they so it would have been 60 So it's like, pay 20 to make sure you don't lose your 40 Seemed crazy to me. But now today we were gonna have to go to the storage unit if this didn't come today. And the problem is I don't even know if they'd accept that cop, that original, but like the how sh shitty it is. Um, and oh, we don't have time. I have another appointment, and then we weren't gonna have time with the Ubers. They take too long to go to storage and make it to our. I was gonna, about to cancel our uh, appointment for mm -hmm. the passports, but we didn't. So we got our appointment still. And we got all the documents. His. His mother's birthplace, as y'all see, Panama. His mother, most people. Look at one thing. Mine on. has like a ton of okay. stuff written. Here's an Oregon one. And here's. I always saw other people's and theirs were so simple and mine was like always so elaborate and uh, mine was such a faded copy of this. It was so bad. Your mom's from New Jersey. Yeah, that's what I said. She was born in New Jersey. She lived in Long Island, but she was born in New Jersey. But there she didn't. Go. She didn't live ever in New Jersey. It was okay, like, so she was only a child there. She was like a baby in, in New Jersey. Okay, so she, she, was, she didn't live there for how long? New Jersey, she was only maybe there for like, while she was just like a baby. And then they moved to Long Island. Oh, okay. So she pretty much didn't even remember that. No, she didn't ever live in New Jersey. Yeah. But like, not as like... A They're like, oh, we got a baby. Better move to Long Island. Yeah, they didn't. So she's not aware of New Jersey, but she was born in New Jersey. Just like your mom was born in Columbia, technically. But then, it's interesting they put Panama. Well, I think... It's she grew up in Panama. Well, it's because the part where she... This is what you need to learn. learn. The part of Panama where she was born used to be Colombia. I haven't seen my mom's signature in a long time. Thanks, Laura Shagru, for helping us do all this. I should cook patches in here. They don't have the dad's side, huh? Sure. You didn't trust them. 
you, you're saying mine was such an average. Very, very, very serious. Yours is like nothing. Mine is like like a Nevada, <laughs> Nevada medical cards. Mm -hmm. I always thought mine was. What were you feeling right there? What were you feeling for the camera? What was going on? Oh, I just hadn't seen my mom's signature in a long time. So I just made me. It was sad. It's good sad. But it's all good. It's all good. We're in a good place, but it's just sad sometimes because, of course, we miss my mom. But let's see. Oh, I'm so glad we did this. We saved ourselves $40 total because we were going to pay 20 on each, but I sure chanced that a little too. I didn't know we were going to Panama. Oh, let's make copies of these, like you said. Okay. No, I'm going to make photocopies. But why, but why do we need copies? Well, now I just feel like we should. Because they'll look because identical to those. I know, but now I just feel like we should because they take them, even though we need these again. But I just feel like we should just, okay. just because. Anyways, oh, I'm so happy. We're going to Panama. We're going to the Passport Agency tonight at 6.30. Shout out to my man Kelly Kwame, we on top, shout out, shout out, check it out. 